Hello and welcome to Pulse News on the Go. Brought to you by Welcome to Pulse News on the Go, the major news headlines for today. An accountant and his assistant at the Keta Government Hospital have been accused of siphoning the hospital's internally generated funds to the tune of 576,000 Ghana cities. The money that was meant for the purchase of some logistics and drugs for the Keta community could not be accounted for when the Public Accounts Committee inquired from the Ministry of Health. The 2016 presidential candidate of the New Patriotic Party, Nanado Dankwe Kufuado, has urged Ghana to vote for him and the NPP to turn the fortunes of Ghana around. He made this known when he addressed victims of two separate fire outbreaks at the Kumasi Central Market and the Dagomba Line area in Abuabo. The Acting Inspector General of Police, John Kudalo, has directed the Criminal Investigations Department to take over investigations into circumstances that led to the shooting of a man at Alajo in Accra. The police on Thursday detained the police officer, Sergeant Adoye, who shot the suspect, Joseph Ajay, along with a murder suspect, Adisha Bagaji. The police mistook the deceased, Joseph Ajay, for an armed robber. In sports, we take a look at Ghanaian players to watch out for across Europe this weekend. In Spain, Inaki Williams will try to put up a good show while Thomas Tepate will hope to play against Atletico Madrid. Away to Italy, Kevin Prince Boateng could make his first start in his second stint at AC Milan as they travel to face Empoli on Saturday. And in England, Jordan Ayew Aston Villa will head to nearby West Brom on Saturday, whilst his elder brother Andre Ayew will will be in action for Swansea at the Goodison Park against Everton on Sunday. And that was your Paul's News on the Go, brought to you by...